All right, guys, we are back. Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy CMB checking in with another celebrity news segment. And we are talking Diddy, guys. Sean P. Diddy Combs. I know you guys are probably tired of hearing about Diddy. Uh, I am myself. I did make a couple of videos and I kind of left it alone. But uh, I go up and down my feed and all I see is uh, Diddy this, Diddy that, day and night. Nothing but a smorgasbord of Diddy videos. But I did think it was important to come on because we do have some breaking news about P. Diddy. And I did mention in my last video, I'll say this first, that, you know, it could be a case where Diddy never sees the light of day again. And looking at this breaking news and these allegations, uh, it's not looking good for him. Uh, he's looking more and more guilty every day. Uh, it says that Sean Diddy Combs hit with 120 new sexual assault allegations. 120 guys. So it says lawsuits will be filed after a Texas-based attorney said he has compiled 120 new accusers claiming allegations against Sean Diddy Combs. NBC News' Chloe Malas reports the attorney Tony Busby said allegations would also be eventually made against other unnamed celebrities. Other unnamed celebrities. So let that sink in. That means there is more celebrities that's going to be charged. It's just not going to be Diddy. This is why you haven't heard a lot from the people in Hollywood, the people in music. They've been laying low. They've been staying quiet because they know that they may be on these, these tapes uh, doing, you know, unthinkable acts. So let that sink in. I wouldn't be surprised if some of these guys uh, try to flee. I don't know who they are. Maybe you guys can speculate, put down in the comment section who you think they are, but I think this is going to be a bombshell. So let me play the audio for you real quick so I can catch you guys up to speed on this. Let me play this real fast. Let me stop that for a second, guys. They said the youngest was nine years old. Nine years old. Like I said, he may not ever see the light of day again. Let's play this. I think I rewinded it back a little bit, but let's let's play it. By Combs. For the first time, we are hearing about victims who say they were minors when they were allegedly assaulted by the music star. The youngest allegedly just nine years old. The allegations were revealed today by attorneys representing more than 100 alleged victims who are preparing to sue. So let's bring in NBC News entertainment correspondent Chloe Malas right now. So Chloe, we know there is currently a press conference underway. We do have a live picture of that. Can you just walk us through these new allegations and tell us if we've heard from Combs yet? So the individual that you see on the screen right now, that is an attorney based out of Houston, Texas, and his name is Tony Busby. He's been a part of some very well-known litigation uh, over the years involving the BP oil spill, even involving the Astroworld Music Festival uh, crisis where some individuals were killed during a stampede. So he um, has made headlines before, but this is uh, pretty shocking. So he claims, at this, is claiming right now at this press conference that he has had over 3,000 individuals reach out to his law firm in Houston, Texas, that he and his team have been vetting these claims, that now they are representing over 120 accusers, and that over the next... Did you guys hear that? They said he had over, this attorney said he had over 3,000 people reach out to him about this Diddy situation. 3,000 people. Right now, he, you know, he has 120 new allegations, but uh, 3,000 people, that, that's a hell of a lot of people, guys. So let's continue. Um, he says that his team 
accusers who were allegedly minors at the time that these uh, allegations took place starting in, in 1991 mm. span all the way um, up over two decades um, he also talks about where these individuals are from he said that they hail from more than 25 states new york california yeah. florida we know that diddy had a residence in miami uh, georgia um, we've reached out to sean combs his legal team for comment they have not yet responded. Combs is currently being held at the Metropolitan Deten Detention Center in Brooklyn uh, while he is awaiting trial on the New York indictment where he is charged with racketeering, um, sex trafficking, and uh, prostitution uh, charges. Now, I also just want to point out um, that they also claim that 62% of these individuals uh, are identifying as an African American and that they are evenly split between female accusers and male all right guys so you you guys heard that uh, a bunch of shocking stuff going on they said that 62 percent of the accusers were african-american and they were split between female and male so we know there's been a lot of talk about diddy being you know sexually assaulting men as well as women and uh like I said, where there's smoke, there's fire, guys. They're also talking about, you know, sexually assaulting minors. This is crazy, man. This 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 is absolutely insane. He may never see the light of day again. And the biggest bombshell is other celebrities, household names doing the same thing. Now, I know we've all speculated that this type of stuff goes on in Hollywood. But to see it actually, you know, being brought to light. You know, it, this this is different. We're in different territory now. And Cat Williams was right. A lot of people were going to be exposed this year. And that's exactly what's happening. I don't know how he knew it, but, you know, he, he hit the nail on the head with this one. And uh, this is going to be a shit show, guys. So you guys let me know what you think about Sean P. Diddy Combs and all these new sexual assault allegations. 120 guys. And who knows? There may be even more coming. We, we just, you know, have to wait and see. Uh, it's disgusting. It's disgusting. And uh, I, I think I like my mundane life better than what what these people are doing. But you guys let me know what you think about this one in the comments section. It's the CMB. I'll talk to you guys in the next one. And I'm out. Peace.